to with our U.S. Women's National Team. Just here to send a message to all of you guys. Um, I know that this has been such a challenging time for our whole country, for this world, and for our sport. And our national team, we just had our season postponed and some things canceled. And so we grieved that back in March when that happened as our season happens in the summer. As I know a lot of you guys are dealing with that right now for the fall. And I just want to let you know that you're not here alone. Athletes, coaches, we're here for you. National team, our athletes, our coaching staff, we're all in this together. Um, our team has done an incredible job, I think coaches and athletes alike, of staying safe, making sure we're taking really good precautions with things, but then also taking a chance to grow and learn in other ways. Maybe we wouldn't have carved out time for this year, this season, we're able to get better at our culture. We're able to get better at certain skills in the court that are more individualized, that we maybe wouldn't have spent as much time if we had six on six and matches happening. So I encourage you to think about time like that. Feel all the feels that are gonna be happening as things start to change, but what can you control that is going to help impact your game right now? So we're here for you and um, good luck. Hey everyone, my name is Tama Miyashiro and I'm one of the assistant coaches with the women's national team. And I just wanted to send some good positive vibes to the entire volleyball community right now. Uh, there's a lot of uncertainty with cancellations or postponements. Um, but I encourage you to just take it one day at a time. And let's try to finish this year off really strong. We've had our season delayed by a year. That is the USA team hoping to have a strong Olympics next year, have it happen. We're hoping you get to have a strong spring season. So sending out some prayers for all of that to happen. A uh, couple big things that are for me takeaways out of this. Number one, it's really easy for us to focus on the, the days when things don't go well or when something big and not great happens to think why me or why us or why our team or why all of us seniors, why is this happening? But it's a, a big lesson in keeping an eye out, keeping some level of gratitude when a day happens when nothing horrendous goes wrong or maybe a day happens and some great stuff happens. We rarely, it's just human nature that we don't do this, but it's really important to say, why me when good things happen too? And then we can balance it out days uh, and seasons like this with the good seasons that we've had. And then the other is not asking why me when something bad like this happens, but instead flipping it to what's the good in this for me? What is the good in this for our team? What can we use out of this awful rotten situation? And this isn't the only thing. 2020 has just been a really tough year in so many ways. So we can all ask ourselves, what, what is the good in this? What can I use out of this situation to help me be a better teammate, be a better person? What can we use as a team to be better for each other?